Hello, everyone. We're going to talk about the deflationary aspect of Quorium today. As we know, there's a max supply of 500 million uh, tokens that will ever exist. Now, did you know? Did you know that there's also a burn mechanism? So this is my buddy Taj sent me. So many people are talking about Quorium. The buzz is starting to happen. Fuck, oh, Quorium is deflationary too. 20% block fees burned after each block is closed after four hours. 60% goes to validators, 20% burned forever. So this is one of the mechanisms that's going to help drive the value of Corium through the roof. So the 20% burned uh, in these, uh, pretty awesome. So now let's talk about, you know, what's happening in the world and also the Zen Lounge. So uh, everything, there's an invasion, Russia invaded uh, Ukraine. Let's, let's not talk about whether you're you're pro that or against that. Let's just talk about what this means for us as people. Um, I mean, we had the warning, if you've been following my channel for a long time, uh, for the past year, uh, I think the only reason why people have been following me this long is because I'm not perfect, but I do my best to help you guys stay ahead. That's my whole mission is just help you guys stay ahead. And um, I, that's really all I'm trying to do for you guys gas prices we had the warning many people are have no idea what's coming this russia ukraine conflict gas prices have spiked i hear some tips for saving at the pump uh, i'm not going to read this but it says the national average price for gasoline has reached three dollar to 59 cents up 33 cents so far all planned um gas could keep going up now is gas the only thing that's going to keep going up? We also have the trucker movement. It's going to delay um, the, the supply chain. Other food's going to go up. Gas going up. Are, are the wages going to go up with the speed of all this inflation? Probably not. Probably not. Are people prepared? No. And that's one of the reasons, man, I literally had a rough day yesterday. I really felt the emotions of the world and I felt so sorry for the people in Ukraine and just, just the, it's been a rough two years. 2020 is when this all began. And it's like, we haven't been able to have a break. Like so many people wish that we could go back before all this ever happened. And, you know, it doesn't look like we're going back anytime soon, which is, you know, the uncomfortable uh, feeling right now, because now we're basically entering conflict. <laughs> now it's getting even more serious. So that's exactly why I chose to uh, keep the Telegram community going. So uh, as you guys know, I've had all types of, you know, just nasty things and ridiculous people, ridiculous things that people, I've even had someone message me, they want to put a bullet to my head. And I have a family come, I have a baby on the way and I dedicate so much time to, and also the whole point of the telegram is to be a place where the black sheeps could talk about things that, you know, it's not accepted anywhere else. And then it, it got so big, like it's only been a year and have 8,000 people on YouTube, 5,000 people on telegram. It started with, you know, 20, hundred people, just as friends decoding, talking about crazy shit that, isn't really accepted anywhere else. So that was our safety zone. And then people, you know, we got so big, people just go in there and want to like shoot you anytime you make a mistake, shoot you anytime, you know, they see that you're weak and vulnerable. You know what? I don't care. Say whatever you guys want to say. We're going to keep this party going. I'm going to keep the movement alive for you guys based on all the comments and based on somebody posted a Mike Tyson video. Thank you. That Mike Tyson video about haters saved my whole view on how I'm going to approach this going forward. Kanye West, I could let these dream killers kill my self esteem or use my arrogance to the steam to power my dreams. And we're going to use, we're going to use this energy to steam power our dreams and the movement, the community is going to be so much stronger and, uh, we're going to come together and, you know, if Bob and Reza let all the hate and all the BS stop them from creating Sologenic, then we wouldn't have Sologenic. So I can't, and also you guys just see me, I got banned from the Sologenic and Corium community. 
I love, I'm the biggest Sologenic and Corium community. How do you think that makes me feel? That's how much of a black sheep I am. I'm never, <laughs> I'm never, uh, I don't fit into any group or any community. I get kicked out of everywhere I go. I used to get kicked out of clubs uh, in Las Vegas back in, back when I was uh, 21, 22 years old. Uh, real fact, 86 from the win. Like that's, I'm, I'm kicked out everywhere I go. So nothing against Bob and Reza, just these telegram admins are freaking bots. Tell them I said it. So um, we have to keep this community going. So we have a place where we could feel welcome. We could, we could uh, keep this thing going. So that's what I'm going to have. That's what I have to say about the telegram community. We're keeping it going. Um, Corium is coming within the next, what day is it? Three days now. So we should have Corium within the next three days, hopefully announcement today. So um, we're getting to, to the wire, to the wire right now, guys, everybody have an awesome day and peace.